hi guys welcome welcome back to my youtube channel if you are a returning subscriber thank you thank you so much for watching one of my videos once again and if you are new here welcome i hope you just stay and become a part of my journey as i've become a doctor and you guys welcome back to another video today we are not having a weekly vlog for sure you can tell by the title we are having um a young sunday reset well it's not a sunday reset because today is a saturday it's more of like a weekend reset type of thing i just wrote my exams on thursday i wrote a trauma exam of which it was okay compared to what i went through yesterday yesterday i wrote i wrote ortho and that exam was so difficult it was an mcq um 100 questions and honestly you might think that multiple choice is very easy up until you come to medical school ne? and i yeah honestly that exam just usually i am very much happy and you know in a celebratory <laughs> mood every time i finish my exams because i'm like oh i'm done it's time to rest but this weekend i am just so stressed and not only just stressed about my marks i'm stressed because next week i'm supposed to do my two-week elective like from monday but i do not have an elective side and i do not know how this happened because for the past month i've been trying to find an elective side and most of them were like we are fully booked for this year and i just got discouraged because i was like i don't want to do an elective in literally just anything you know i want to do an elective in something that i'm interested in and then um some people didn't reply to my emails and then last week i think wednesday if not thursday thursday after i wrote my trauma exam i decided to walk in to do like a walk-in application at gsh i went to cardiothoracic so i was like okay you know what it will be very really interesting to do an elective in cardio cardiothoracics but they told me they are booked for the whole year cardiology hasn't replied to my emails so i'm quite stranded but anyways guys i am not here to bother you with my problems but what i'm trying to say is my mood is really not at its best right now and that's why i decided you know what let me actually just clean my room and maybe that will make me feel better maybe that will make me feel better so let me show you guys my she in package for sure you guys are so excited about that excited as i am i had actually started opening it because trust me i was contemplating not to vlog i was like let me just actually do a sheen haul on tiktok just do a tiktok video you know but i was like hmm i promised you guys that i'm gonna do it here on youtube i'm gonna make a video she in haul and all that stuff so yeah that's why i started vlogging and i thought i was gonna make it like a separate video like a strictly she in haul video but i realized that the stuff are actually not as many to do a long video the video would probably be like 15 minutes and you know that this year we are not doing that this year we are standing on business we are doing long videos so i was like nah let me just like mix it up with like a, a sunday reset type of thing so that's what we're doing today so let's get into the haul i'm just gonna show you segment by segment as we actually clean around my room i just stripped my bed off i want to take stuff to the laundry so probably let's just start with that i remember getting locked up in myself that thing of loving was for everybody else Been hurt too many times. Gave up on hoping, thought I'd never get it right.
dropped off my clothes in the laundry room and i want to make some food guys i am so hungry my ifra has actually been treating me so well i've been enjoying making meals using my air fryer like it's so easy within 20 minutes you just done i've made like a video compilation on tiktok of the meals that i prepared um using my air fryer like for the past two weeks so if you're interested in you know knowing please follow me on tiktok i feel like i campaign my tiktok page so much on this youtube and i've actually just um we reached 150,000 followers on TikTok. Thank you so much to everyone who's following me on TikTok. I really do appreciate it. Like, yo, guys, we've come a long, long way. I'm thinking of buying cake tomorrow to celebrate that and candles. Um, yeah, and also it's, it's because I've been craving carrot cake from Woolworths. Like, I'm a huge fan of that cake, and I've been kind of like looking for an excuse to buy the cake so yeah right now i think i want to make food guys my fridge has been giving me so much problems because of load shedding i'm gonna show you the deep freezer it just like you know when there's load shedding it defrosts and then a lot of water just like form in that deep freezer and then when the electricity comes back again it freezes so now there's this huge ice that i can't even close the deep freezer door so um i decided to switch it off this morning so i want to wash the fridge as well but i have a tray of wings in the fridge i want to make that and slap chips um using my air fryer just quick lunch and then from there we'll just continue with the whole sunday reset guys they don't tell you these creators don't tell you how long it takes to clean and how long it takes to do these sunday resets because i've just put my clothes in the laundry and i'm like let's just call it a day i'm tired because usually for me i do not have like a cleaning day like i do not have like okay this is the day i'm dedicating it to cleaning no like if i'm doing laundry today tomorrow maybe i'll like clean my bathroom and then the other day i'm gonna mop my room you get what i'm saying dishes yes i do like that almost like every night or every morning um but when it comes to cleaning my room i do not just routinely just clean everything do laundry pack my clothes because it takes me the whole day and i don't want to dedicate my whole day to cleaning like i have other stuff to do but then because i am shooting the video I have to do everything at once and you know when they post those videos on tiktok you think it took them a minute to actually clean their whole room and stuff like that because they edited to be so short no it takes a whole day so now i just want to make quick food um let's actually get let's actually make food and let me show you my fridge so this is what i'm talking about um these are the wings I want to make anyway. I hope they're still fine. Because I switched off the fridge once. I hope they're still fresh. So you see this is what's been happening. Also the ice has like... Now it's smaller because you see it's... It's really melting because I switched off the fridge. But now everything is just stuck in here. Because the water comes from here and then it melts all the way down and then it stays here and then it actually just freezes so yeah i'm gonna make chips as well oh my goodness when i make these chips i can take them out i'm gonna make these chips and i'm just gonna spice the wings right now and put them in the air fryer while we continue to clean
okay guys here is the Shein package for sure you guys have seen it on my last video it's already opened unfortunately I opened it on a TikTok video because I needed um, a couple of stuff from there but I'm gonna show you guys exactly what I took out and as the video goes we are definitely gonna take out everything eventually because I bought stuff for like my desk for my um, bathroom as well and other like general stuff that I need um, as a student like something to put my student card and all that stuff so I wanna un I don't just wanna sit down and unbox everything at once I wanna unbox while I show you how I'm actually planning to use this stuff you get what I'm saying so right now I wanna go clean my bathroom so let me show you what I got for my bathroom so this is the stuff that I already unboxed for my TikTok. So um, firstly we have this. If you watched my move in or my bathroom decor, whatever she in haul on my previous race, you know that I bought this. So I had to buy it again because it gets stuck on the shower. So um, it's really hard to peel these things off when they get stuck there and I think if you peel them off you'll never be able to stick them anywhere else again so I actually left that in my previous shower at that dress Ooh, it comes with these things so these things you're able to like stick them on the wall they are not silver you can peel the silver thing off and then they are clear you stick it so you stick them on the wall of your shower and then I'll show you guys when I do it and then you're able to hang this you can remove it and whatsoever and then the second thing that I got um, was this cute little thing to put my bar soap also for the shower I didn't really want to put it in there because I feel like it was going to be overcrowded with my body washes and stuff so I got this on its own it also comes with this thing you're gonna see it when I stick it on to hook it in there and i love that it has these hooks as well on the side so you can hook like your for maybe your shaving razor you can hook like your sponge your gloves or anything that you'd like to hang in your shower and then the third thing which is probably the last thing i got for my bathroom was this i'm quite a little bit disappointed because i expected this to be like a little bit longer but yeah i needed additional um rack or whatever to hang my towel because already what's built in there is not enough you know for my face cloths and my underwears and stuff like that i'm probably gonna buy more but i saw this and i was like oh this is so cool also it comes with stuff to stick on the wall and actually just like slip it in there it's like plastic but on the actual on the actual website it looked like it was like metal um but anyway it will do its function i almost forgot guys i bought stuff from clicks this morning so let's do a quick clicks haul um yeah Firstly, firstly, I got a, a toothpaste, a charcoal with whitening, what, white glow advantage, deep clean, blah, blah, blah. I do have a toothpaste, but I feel like an ordinary toothpaste doesn't do well for me, simply because I drink a lot of coffee and I feel like now my teeth are catching this brown tint no matter how much I brush them so I'm just like let me actually get an actual toothpaste that says it's for whitening teeth you get what I'm saying and see if it's gonna work so this one is a charcoal one um, hopefully hopefully it helps me because I need my teeth to be bright and white and then the next thing is a body wash from Nivea uh, what must I do? a body wash from Nivea rose and almond I usually use the one from Dove but 
it was so damn expensive at this clicks like 96 rand or something and i usually buy it for like 64 rand at this cam i'm not sure if it's this clicks or the price went up i don't I, I really don't know but yeah i decided to buy this one and then i got bath gloves how cute are these i love the color why is this focus so bad i love the color guys they are super cute and then um i got a body scrub i wanted the pink one. Oh, this one matches with my nails so good guys i constantly have to adjust the focus of this camera and that's a So this is how the the wings turned out they're a little bit burnt guys i, sh I think i left them a, a little bit too long in the air fryer um so i took them out two minutes ago 
and toast them in tomato sauce because I like them a little bit saucy and a little bit sweet and then I put them back for two minutes and this is how they came out I actually kind of like them um, so right now I'm just gonna remove them and put my frozen chips in there and then spice them and then that will be my lunch for the day All along it was a fever Cold sweat, hot-headed believer I threw my hands in the air, said show me something She said if you dare come a little closer ugly corner this is how of a mess my study desk is look at it a huge huge mess because i feel like i just throw everything on that table 
so that is why i was like you know what i need to organize it i can't leave like this i simply cannot so that's what we are about to do now i just had to give you guys a disclaimer because wow ah, i know i know yo like this is a mess to screw this literally like this on there's no other pieces that I have to bob the bill I love this I literally love this it also came with like a little manual on how to build it oh which is so cool So this is how it looks guys it is smaller than I had expected like it's way shorter but I am not mad but I thought it was gonna be maybe somewhere here to the level of the bed but also I think it, it is better this way because I don't want to be turning around and my face be literally on the desk <laughs> so I think it is better for it to be lower because there is somehow a difference that I can tell that okay now I'm no longer on my bed I am falling off <laughs> also like I don't want to be turning around and then be facing things that are on the desk so yeah so now it's time to actually put stuff on guys how pretty <laughs> it's my first time burning a candle I bought this candle last year when I moved into my new res but I've been telling myself I'm gonna buy you know something to light it something to light it but I never really did and right now I'm looking at this I'm like how beautiful you know I always see content creators lighting candles after cleaning the feeling is amazing the fit is it's the feeling for me it's the oh so right now, I decided to just put my Bible on there and obviously the candle. But this is not the final setup. I think stuff that I want to use, that I might use, um, are in the Shein haul or in the Shein box that I'm about to unbox right now. So we'll decide together which setup will be great. I just didn't want to set up, you know, take stuff out of the box without showing you guys. So yeah i am so happy oh this is so beautiful if you're wondering i got the candle from pep pep home yes i am gonna buy a lot of candles like i'm in my candle era oh, 
this is so beautiful my room is about to smell nice like don't play with me okay let's do this my stuff actually came in a box just because not because there are many just because there are a lot of frames in here i can say um, you'll see as we unpack So first we have this alarm clock as i've said guys i'm shooting for um tiktok as well so yeah i'm multitasking here it's actually smaller than i had expected but i'm not really mad at it i thought it would be really and it would be really it would be a really nice decor item do you get what i'm saying not really that i really need an alarm clock my phone works for me pretty well so yeah i'm gonna see if i put it on my desk or i put it on my study desk or on my what is it the one that we just unboxed right now on my side table yes i'm gonna decide whether i put it there or on my study desk and then next up we have So next up we have what is this we have um, a desk pad or a mouse pad um, I really loved it because of the color I thought hmm this would really be nice from a deco point of view not really from like a, me using a mouse because I don't really use a mouse so yeah we'll see how that one goes Sorry for the burden, sorry I was hurting But my scars are almost 
literally a couple of days later <sighs> so when i was actually organizing my desk the last time you guys saw me load shedding hit at around 8 p.m and i couldn't continue because i wasn't going to continue at 10 right so i was like okay you know what i'm going to shoot the following day and stuff like that and a lot of things happened i ended up studying my elective this week finally i got an elective site um so yeah days went by today's like a thursday i know but just gonna i'm just gonna give you guys a quick update of what i've done so far i've literally stopped when i the last time i filmed is the last time i actually did something on this desk because i still wanted to update you guys you know what i'm saying so the haul is still going on that's what i'm trying to say but so far we have let me turn my camera for sure you guys saw me um organize this part of my desk um this is what i got from shein and this i think i want to add 2024 here because i feel like this is too high up and i don't want to move it down so i thought maybe let me just add 2024 and this thing is literally so smaller than i had expected but i find it so cute and that silver stand over here i wanted it specifically for my youtube award that we unboxed on the previous video if you haven't watched that video please go back and watch it if you want to hear more about my youtube journey how i reached to where i am today and all that stuff i um bought this as well to organize my textbooks as you might see there up there my textbooks are literally you know packed like that i want to actually like organize them in this and see how is that gonna look so up there i have not done anything i want to also put my ooh, not me dropping my alarm clock honey okay it's not broken um i want to put my vision board up there as well uh so yeah as i've said guys i literally stopped the last time i saw you and i'm just gonna give you a whole entire sort of like final look of the desk when we done so that you can see everything that i have done but also i have a couple of stuff that i want to show you guys so there might have been a couple of stuff that you guys were not able to see because I'm, I'm not sure if I mentioned that the camera ran out of battery and then for a moment I was just um, unboxing for my TikTok using my phone and then I then um, went back to my camera again when it gained a little bit of battery. So during that time you guys missed some stuff that I actually unboxed so I'm going to show you guys now. So first of all, it's this small bag, let me adjust the lighting, it's this small bag that I've got, I wanted it because I wanted to keep my sanitary pads, I kind of like demonstrated it on TikTok so that's why they're in here, so I thought um, it's actually cute, you know? Um, let's say I want to, you know, do my thing in the bathroom. I don't have to literally take my whole bag with me. I can literally just like, and nobody is going to look at me in a funny way. Not that people look you in a funny way when you're holding your pad, but I just don't want to be. So that's why I got this. Also, I just want to have a, 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 a good supply in my bag. You get what I'm saying? So I'm not sure if I've shown you guys this, but this thing comes with these um, alphabets and numbers. As you might see, there's like more than one alphabet. So see there are a lot of O's. I think it's like six each alphabet. Yeah, a lot of O's, a lot of A's and C's and also even it comes with numbers as well here at the bottom, which is so great because you can literally create any message that you want that's what i liked about it like i can i can put my favorite code here if i want to and yeah and the next thing that i actually have bought is 
this thing over here which is actually so smaller than I expected so it's basically a shelf it's basically a shelf that's supposed to go under your desk let's say this is your desk it's supposed to stick under so that you can just like open it like I'm so bad at demonstrating open it like this and then you store stuff because I do not have shelves and I thought I would like to keep like my pens my highlighters and all the small little stuff that I don't want on my desk on here but this is so way smaller than I expected but I'm still gonna use it anyway and then um, I'm just gonna go in a random order I also bought this this is a mic I'm not sure if you guys can see this but it's like a mic that connects to your phone um, you know those ones that people use on TikTok like hi guys welcome back to my TikTok <laughs> I'm not gonna be doing that though but um, I wanted to improve my TikTok sound quality so i was like you know what let me try this i once bought this on tiktok like last eh, on take a lot like last year i didn't like it i didn't like how it sounded and i returned it but now i saw this and it was cheap on tiktok uh, on chain i was like let me just try it again you know oh yeah this i've actually not unboxed yet i think i'm gonna unbox it officially when i unbox on tiktok talk it is sort of um what's the name of the actual thing multifunctional multifunctional cleaning brush so i bought this for my macbook so you're able to like clean the keyboard the screen and whatsoever i'm going to demonstrate to you guys when i actually do that also unboxed this bag which I don't actually like that much um, My bag that I'm using now I also bought it from Shein But now yo, it has torn apart Like if it's really Because So I was like you know what Let me get a new one But this one is different It is smaller Way smaller um, Same material though But oh, I don't think it will fit um, My MacBook in here That's how small it is So I was thinking should I just use it for my lunch or I should give it to my little sister? I don't know. But I like the fact that it has like a lot of pockets that like you can put like a bottle of water or juice and something in here and whatsoever. But it is just way too small. Hmm. Yeah. And then I'm trying to find the other things that I didn't show you guys. This. I bought um, something to put my student card it is literally so so cute good quality I bought it with this thingy it looks like a, a key holder of some sort it's actually a heart I'm trying to you guys see it can you see it it's actually a heart with like labels on it um, I love it so behind it you can actually like clip like that on your scraps or whatever so yeah that's another thing i'm trying to remember because i unboxed some stuff and they were scattered all over the place uh, macbook macbook cover macbook screen protector macbook um keyboard cover uh i don't know where i put those things but i'm gonna find them and when i find them we're just going to um, clean the MacBook and put the cover on and all the protectors right now.
hard to film filming for TikTok and um, YouTube besides that putting on those screen protectors oh I was struggling obviously I edited that out and it looks like I got it on first try but I kept on sticking and removing sticking and removing because I couldn't get it straight but anyways how cute how cute is my guys I keep on dropping this alarm clock honestly how cute is my you come Oh my goodness, the lighting here is not doing any justice, but you guys have seen it. I love that it's not only the front, but the back that is literally covered. I was so stressed about having this make book naked. Like I do not have insurance for it. I paid it, I paid for it cash and stuff like that. So I can't like return it back to the store and be like, it's broken, it's cracked. So I was so stressed that should something happen i actually dropped it once at home but luckily it was so fine i think it got a scratch somewhere in the corner a small one but now i am glad that actually i have it protected the cover the screen protector um the thing for the keyboard i actually love it i still have to know whether it should stick or should not stick like guys i didn't read the instructions of these things before shooting the video because probably they i don't know so i went for it and now i was trying to figure things out during shooting the video so yeah it took so long that right now i'm even so so hungry but let's carry on now we left with organizing the top um shelf and then after that i'm just gonna give you guys a quick show of how it's actually looking and then we will be finally done with the haul finally done with the video i'm gonna go and shoot in actually and confirm if i've showed you guys everything that i bought because i bought a lot of stuff and because i've been unboxing piece by piece i might have lost some of the stuff not really lost but like there's somewhere in this room so let me confirm that and then we're gonna finish up organizing my study desk. okay guys i want to put this on but I realized that it came with this thing, of which I th I think it is for sticking this on, like under my desk. But also it came with screws, like these little screws over here. Not sure if you guys can see them. I think maybe it also has a screw on option, because it has like these little holes here. So you can either decide whether you want to screw it on or stick it. I'm definitely gonna stick it on. I hope it, you are not supposed to do both. That it's not gonna be strong with this only. Because that would be not cool, <laughs> you know. This is how many stuff it actually feeds. I was able to feed like eight highlighters in here. So as you can see, the space is not too much. You can use it for pens, pencils, whatsoever. I was just trying it out with the highlighters. So yeah, I mean, it's not the best quality I can say. I feel like if you can put on, put in the heavy stuff, it will definitely um, fall off because you can see with these highlighters if you open it way too much it kind of like looks like it's gonna fall off but I think it's pretty it's still pretty nice I'm not sure if 
Shein has a, a bigger size. I would love a bigger size um, because I think it would be very much better because it will keep a lot of stuff in. I'm not sure if I should put it this way or I should put it this way. Oh, I'm trying to force it. I should put it this way. No. I think maybe this way will work better. I actually don't know. What do you guys think? Uh, Maybe this way, ne? I think that looks so much better. Guys, I have so many books. I want to sell a lot of them. Because most of them, I've been using them in like first year, second year. I still have them. And some of them I don't actually use. So... Hmm. Let me just sell those. Ne? Get a It's coming together. It is coming together. For example, I bought this coloring book for third year. It's still sealed, as you can see. If you want it, DM for price. <laughs> I'm not even joking. Comment and then I'll sell it to you. It's really brand new, like sealed, sealed, sealed. I don't think I need to pick it up here because honestly, I'm gonna. And I have this one, Hematology. I think I got it in second year. This one I'm not selling because I got it from um, PBL, UCT. And I realized years later that I actually forgot to bring the book back, so... I'm gonna give it to you for free if you're a UCT student, of course. Um, and then I have Grey's Anatomy. This one might sell it to you, DM for price. Just gonna put it here though. And then, oh, I have. Kumar and Clark Clinical Medicine. I don't know why I'm <laughs> selling my textbooks. But the thing is, I don't read textbooks. I know it's so bad. I read like PDFs and websites and all of that stuff. Reading a whole textbook? Yo, I never got enough time, shame, um, to read a textbook. So if you want to buy a textbook from me, let me know. Neuroanatomy. This is really good. This is some really good stuff. I barely used this book as well. It's been here. Let me just put it somewhere here. And yeah. I think those are the those are all the books that I have, but I'm not happy that this is just floating around. So let me just try and adjust it accordingly so that it looks proper. Oh my goodness. I'm trying to make it look neat, 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 neat. Neat, 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 neat. Is this better, guys? Does this look better? Okay, now the real struggle is to lift this thing up. Damn. Is it not gonna break? Oh, it's gonna break. No way it's gonna break. Okay, let me take off some books. Let me just take the big ones out. 
and try and lift from the bottom put these up okay okay lift like a cake uh, uh i'm not gonna be able to take it up there what was i thinking andy was your math math thing when you did that okay guys let me just arrange it from the top okay guys let's do a quick tour let's start from the top we have firstly my plant that needs a proper um blonde board i you know i am what is it i water it right and then the water tends to just like drop down or whatever it leaks from that thing so that's why it has a plastic on and then my vision board and then the the box up there and then on the second floor we have my youtube award my dstv content creator award this cute heart over there and then becoming dr andy 2024 finally edited the 2024 and then down here we have this two story tray that I put my files on. We have this cute thing for dates. And then um, my alarm clock just for decor, mouse pad, and then my MacBook. So, yeah, that is literally my desk. <music> come to the end of the video thank you thank you so much for watching up until this far i hope you did enjoy it i'll try and link or write down the details of the things that i've shown you on the description box please don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel like and comment about which item did you love i'll see you again on my next video bye